And Kelly, a big topic will be infrastructure. The announcement of the bipartisan infrastructure deal back in November initially sent construction and industrial related stocks higher, but those gains have recently faded. Uh, PAVE infrastructure, infrastructure ETF, you can see, is down about 8% since then. Martin Marietta, Vulcan Materials down about 6%. United Rental, seen as a key beneficiary, down as much as 20%. This despite updates from the administration on funds being carved out for projects related to repair and replace bridges in states like New Jersey and Louisiana, the modernization of dams across the Mississippi River, and the restoration of the Everglades in Florida. Amelius Research says a lack of clarity around capital deployment and when orders will be put into place for major industrials, uh, plus renewed fears around inflation, have kept investors on edge. And that's why the commentary from CEOs of General Electric, Caterpillar, among others, next week will provide a much-needed gauge on where discussions stand with D.C., how these companies are building their inventory levels, making contingency plans for the eventual rollout. Pricing power will also be key. Nearly every industrial has raised prices over the past year. And with inflation remaining high, Wall Street is betting on multiple price increases to be unveiled this year. Tyler?